Does your aging parent or loved one need any help? You're gonna have to um, be able to recognize when your mother, father, your loved one, you know, when they start going through different things, you know, it's gonna be different signs and it's gonna be a lot of stuff, but you're gonna have to notice fast what's going on because you wanna be able to take care of your parents. And um, they're not gonna be able to really communicate verbally well to you that they need some help. So who am I? My name is Kion Church. I am the Delaware District Administrator of Reliable Aid Inc. Um, what do we do? We provide a safe solution for seniors. You know, I just wanted to get on here to talk to you today, you know, um, and let you know, you know, first of all, it's, it's a really scary thing, you know, when to even figure out that your parent or loved one needs a little help. You know, because we look at parents in the uh, in the upper echelon kind of like we look at them as, uh, you know, the most important people in our life. And, um, you know, we kind of look up to them a lot. So we never really want to admit that that, you know, they may need a little help. But everybody, as you go on in time, will need a little help with something. You know, your parents are your best assets. You know, they brought you home from the hospital. They've been helping you out since day one. When you look up, they'll be a little older and they're going to need a little help. So what do you do? You reach out and you help them. You do the best you can. You put one foot forward. You do the best you can. Um, if you need any help, I, I, I wrote a uh, complete, it's called the Complete In-Home Care Training Manual and Handbook. It's the exact same manual that I send the direct care workers out to the loved ones' homes, to, you know, to our families' homes to be able to better take care of them. If you think that that's something that might help you out, I give it to you for free on a uh, digital download, you know, just drop in the comments, say, hey, uh, in-home care manual, free, I got you. You know, it was kind of funny to me, not really funny, but it was different because when I first noticed that my father needed a little help, you know, I wasn't really quite catching on. I came by his house on a, uh, I believe it was like a Sunday and I looked at him and I'm, I'm saying, hey, dad, you all right? And he's saying, yeah, I'm cool. You know, my father's favorite words is, I'm all right, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. So I'm like, what's up, Pop? Is everything cool? He said, yeah, everything's cool. You know, I helped him out. I, I think I, I might have brought him in something to eat, you know. And he happened to be sitting there at the computer table at his favorite chair, you know, playing with his computer. And I looked at him. He said everything was cool, and I was satisfied. I, you know, I gave him the food that I brought for him, and I left. And um, I happened to uh, come back. It took me about a week to get back. I came by next Sunday, you know, the following Sunday. Came by and talked to him again. He was sitting in the same chair, in the same place, at the same computer table, wearing the same clothes. I don't think he had got out the chair in a week. And I was like, wow, what's going on, Dad? And uh, he was saying, oh, everything is cool, man. I'm all right. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Because those are his favorite words. But it, 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 it dawned on me like something's really not okay. And that was the first time I thought about it. And I was like, man, you know, my father really needs some help. Because I know he didn't intend to be here for a week. You know, so that's the time when you need to call in to help. You know, I, I had to realize, look, you know, I'm going to need some bigger guns because, uh, you know, I can't handle this all. You know, I had two parents that was getting old fast and it's only one of me. So, you know, I had to realize, make a conscious decision, you know, that I needed some help. So I reached out and called some people. You know, you may be like me. I know you like me. You are a, uh, an adult child of a senior parent. And if you look up and you may need some help, call me. Um, I got a company called Reliable Aid Inc. What we do is we got the best companionship in the business. We cover everything from uh, your ADLs to, you know, companionship, just coming by, hanging out with you and your parents and your loved ones, or whatever you need us to do. Um, just in a recap, Reliable Aid Inc., your personal assistance professionals. We are your personal assistance professionals. We watch over your family just like they were ours because we care that much. Reliable Aid Inc. takes the worry out of home health care. Please make an informed decision. Call today for your free in-home care assessment. Give us a chance to earn your business. 302-689-3240. Hey, look in the background. Y'all see uh, the license and stuff like that on the wall. I got that 2019 showing. I finally figured out the settings, how I turned that around. So, you know, I'm really happy for that. You know, Mr. KC is making uh, some big moves on the live world. So, look, if you happy to be here with me today, smash the wild face as always. Always remember smash the wild face because we're trying to let everybody around the world know they can get this big hearted caregiver message out. You know, if you have any topics, anything you want the big hearted caregiver to share, you know, anything we need to talk about, you know, leave it in the comments. You know, hashtag me a uh, gray shirt. I don't care. Hashtag me. You're really short. Whatever. Hashtag your uh, your city. You know, where are you watching this from? You know what I mean? 
Uh, let's show as much love as we can. Don't be afraid to love your parents. You know, a lot of people want to shame and blame and be like, oh man, you know, liking and loving people is a bad thing. Loving people is the best thing in the world. You know, we live in a people community. You know what I mean? You got to love yourself first. So if you love yourself and you love your parents, I love you. Thanks for hanging out with me. My name is Mr. KC. Take it easy. We'll talk to you again tomorrow. Goodbye.